And shifting our focus to yet another breaking news update coming in. Prime Minister Narendra Modi had a telephonic conversation today with uh, his Russian counterpart. In fact, uh, with the Russian Premier, the President of Russian Federation, Vladimir Putin, following up on their meeting in Samarkand on the sidelines of the SEO summit, the two leaders reviewed several aspects of the bilateral relationship, including energy cooperation, trade and investments, defense and security cooperation in several other key areas. In the context of the ongoing conflict in Ukraine as well, I believe the Prime Minister did raise that issue with the President of Russia. Shinjoy joining us with more details. What can you tell us about this all-important telephonic conversation, Shinjoy? Well, at this time, usually, the Prime Minister and the President would have met. But this year, there have been a problem with dates and Prime Minister Modi has not been able to go to Moscow. But this was the meeting that they were going to have. And this, of course, was a telephonic conversation. You're right, Ukraine certainly would have come up in the meeting. Also, issues that related to defense. Let's not forget about 60% of India's defense needs are still supplied by the Russians. And that is important. Besides that, economic issues came up. Prime Minister briefed President Putin about what he wants to do as chairman of G20. India is chairman of G20, and the Russians have agreed to cooperate. Also, India is chairman of the SCO, the Shanghai Cooperation Organization, of which Russia is a part. Once again, Russia has agreed to cooperate and help out as far as that is concerned. So there are a lot of things going on vis-a-vis -vis Russia and India. And most importantly, we know that the issue that relates to in energy security, which is a nice way of saying that we will buy petroleum from Russia, is did come up during the conversation, as did the purchase of fertilizer from Russia. Because the Russians have made it very clear that you can buy as much fertilizer as you want. This is something India urgently needs. And Russia has also said, yes, it will continue to supply petroleum to India. Okay. And amongst the several things on the agenda, let's not forget how uh, Putin, Vladimir Putin is among the many global leaders who've been all praises for Prime Minister Narendra Modi as far as, uh, you know, India pursuing its independent foreign policy is concerned. And those were his words. In the meanwhile, stay on with us, Shinji.